All right, so today I'm going to be building a starter home. It's probably going to be a two-bedroom, one-bathroom home. And it's kind of going to be like a tutorial on how to build this starter home. All right, so I built me a little shell. And my floor plan design for this is going to be a living room here. Like, maybe like that. A bathroom here. We're going to just do the bathroom a two-by-three. And we're going to make the living room bigger by one. And right here, I'm going to make this the master bedroom. I feel like the master bedroom should be a little bit bigger. So we're going to make the master bedroom that big. And this would be like a kid's bedroom or a guest bedroom, whatever you want to make it. And right here, I want to make this like a little laundry room or just a little closet to put random stuff in. And of course, this area right here is the kitchen and dining room area. And the living room is obviously right here. And I'm probably just going to go ahead and remove this wall. I feel like the living room shouldn't be closed off. So we're just going to remove that. And for the roofing, I'm going to use this hip roof. And I'm going to use the gable roof. But the main part of the roof is going to be a hip roof. And the gable roof is going to go right here. I might need to uh, pull this in one. I just want this to be too wide because this is going to be like a starter home. And just go ahead and pull that out like that. Because I want to make this like a little front porch. So I need to build a platform. We're going to just pull it out too like that. And use the base game. I'm not sure. Are the columns? Are these columns right here base game? I'm not really sure. I can't remember which items are base game and which ones are not we're just gonna do those in white and since this is a starter home i'm gonna just use um regular siding for this i'm not gonna go too crazy with like different bricks and tiles and all that on the exterior i'm gonna just use um like i always do i always use this gray siding so i'm gonna just use uh i'm gonna use the gray siding this time i'm gonna use the gray siding in the next build i definitely will change it up but i'm gonna use the siding because this is a starter home build so i'm gonna use the gray siding and I think all of these roof trimmings are base game. I'm not really sure. But we're going to just use that. And I'm going to change up this roof pattern. It's a nice roof pattern, but I feel like I want it to be darker. The next thing we need to do is just lift this platform up maybe one or two. And lower this front porch platform down one like that. And the next thing we need to do is add the windows and doors. All right, you guys. So don't hold me to this, but I think this door right here is a base game door. I'm not sure. Like I said before, I'm not sure which doors and which windows and stuff came from base game and which one is not. Not, but I think this is a base game door right here and these are the base game windows I'm gonna go with I feel like these are nice windows maybe we paint these a different color like maybe black and white or uh, whatever other colors like they got I wonder do they have blue and white to match the door and this is gonna be like a little laundry room or closet so I'm gonna just place a window in here all right you guys so I decided to remove that window because this is a laundry room I should have a little door in here this could be like a little mud room or something you know how the laundry room be in the mud room so I'm gonna just put that together and put a door in here all right so as you guys see I decided to remove that window and add a glass door and put a little overhead on it I feel like having a side door is better than having a window in the laundry room all right so moving on into the interior i'm about to get my base game light in these little circle lightings i feel like these gonna fit nicely in here they little and they look nice when you go in the first person mode so i'm gonna use two of those in there in the kitchen in the living room we just gonna put one right here in this little hallway and in there maybe i'll put two in this little room because maybe i'll put a closet in these rooms all right and even if i'm not even doing a base game home build you guys know i always use this paint swatch right here this is the basic standard um base game paint swatch so i'm gonna just use this throughout the whole house and i might think about changing the colors in the bedrooms but i'm pretty sure i'm gonna keep it this same color all right guys and to be honest i can't remember which floors are all base game floors but i'm gonna just go with these ones right here because i'm pretty sure these are base game floors and i'm probably just gonna use this throughout the whole house except for in the laundry room and in the bathroom i'm gonna choose a different floor for in there all right you guys so i'm gonna use these floors right here i know for sure these floors right here are base game floors because i used these in my first ever building the sims so i know these floors right here are base game so i'm gonna use these in the bathroom and in the laundry room all right but let's go ahead and design our kitchen all right you guys so these cabinets right here are one of my favorite base game cabinets i used to always use these when i first started playing sims so we're gonna use these in this kitchen um the kitchen is not gonna be too wide i want to do three of those and then get a corner cabinet and i'm trying to think of how i want to lay this kitchen out because uh, the sink will go here and then i'll probably put a little island right here all right so for the stove i'm gonna go with this stove right here and i'm gonna do all the appliances in black and this is kind of crazy to me because i don't get to use the appliances that i always love using which is the other refrigerator this one right here and this stove right here these are my two go-to stoves that i always use in every build but now i have to use the cooking U pro stove so yeah y'all come and let me know what y'all think of this kitchen and and I see it's a big little gap right here. So I'm thinking about moving the refrigerator over and adding a cabinet there. I feel like this will 
close up that gap and I feel like that make the kitchen look a little bit better and it puts space in between the sink and the refrigerator and this is the sink I'm gonna go with in this kitchen I feel like that looks nice and it kind of plays with the cabinets a little bit um next thing we need to do is get some upper cabinets and I'm gonna kind of miss doing my little two-tone design usually when I do um my other kitchen builds I use my other cabinets and I'll do like gray cabinets on the bottom white up top but in this kitchen right here this is like an older style kitchen so I'm gonna just do everything the same color and I'm gonna place a little half a cabinet here here like that and put a half a tile cabinet above it and i feel like this kitchen looks very nice for the way it's set up we're just gonna put another half a tile above the stove and i'm gonna get one of these little um stove vents like this one i think this is a base game stove vent. i'm not really sure but i'm gonna just place that above the stove like that all right so let's build a little island so for the island should we just use the island cabinets and not use the other ones too i'll be seeing a lot of people do their islands like this i like to take two of these cabinets right here and place two of them inside the island cabinets like that just to make the island a little bit bigger and this is one thing right here that you always got to do when you build an island which is get some bar stools so i'm gonna just use these bar stools right here okay maybe we just go with the black and white um bar stools i feel like that looks nice in this kitchen and the last thing i feel we need to do in this kitchen is add a backsplash and i know this backsplash right here is a base game backsplash so i'm gonna use this one in this kitchen all right so moving on into the living room i wanted to build a little custom fireplace but i don't think that's gonna happen because the way the walls is it needs to be one wider so i can put it in the middle if i try to do it now it's gonna be the wall will be right here and then it'll go down so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna just no use a normal base game fireplace which i'll probably just use this fireplace right here i feel like this looks nice and it's gonna fit in i'm trying to figure out which color i should use maybe we use something like that yeah i'm gonna use that i feel like that looks nice in here all right so next thing we need to do is add some doors to these rooms and i think these are all i know these right here are all base game doors so i'm gonna just use is this a base game door i'm not gonna use that door i'm gonna use this door right here i'm gonna use this door right here as room doors we're gonna do one there there and the sink and toilet and stuff will be on this side so i'll put the door there all right so the bathroom so what i'm gonna do in the bathroom is i'm gonna take vanity the cabinet from the sink i mean and place it in here and i'm gonna do a little bit hack in here like i always do i'm gonna get me a base game sink this one right here and i'm gonna just raise it up in this cabinet and turn this into a bill hack and in this bathroom i'm gonna just use this little plain black mirror i feel like that looks nice it goes with the black handles on the cabinet so i'm gonna just use that and i'm not sure is this taller right here a base game i know they don't have like the little things above them but i feel like all these taller is not base game so i'm gonna just go with this one right here i know this one is definitely base game but we're gonna get this taller right here place it right there and i'm gonna go with this shower tub combo because this is the only other base game shower tub combo i have the other one is from i can't remember which pack that one is from but i'm gonna go with this base game shower tub combo and i like that color in here it kind of matches with the cabinet a little bit y'all drop in the comment section and let me know what y'all think of my starter home build it's a two bedroom one bathroom home um i feel like the kitchen turned out the best out of everything in here the bathroom is nice but it's a small little normal bathroom but i feel like this kitchen turned out the best out of everything in here drop in the comment section and let me know what y'all think it is and i'm gonna catch you guys in the next video.